If you're running a Hackintosh, you may find that you're not getting macOS updates as you would on a real Mac. Here, for example, my Hackintosh is running macOS Sonoma 14.3. But I know that 14.3.1 has already been released, and I've already got the update notifications on my real Macs, but not on this Hackintosh. If I open System Settings, then go to General and Software Update, It'll say checking for updates, but then it'll just say your Mac is up to date, even though I know it really isn't. So let's see how we can fix it. First run Open Core Auxiliary Tools or OCAT. If you don't already have OCAT, there'll be a link down in the video description. When OCAT runs, click the icon at the top labeled Mount ESP, then select your boot drive in the list and click Mount and Open Config.plist. Then type your password and click OK. When your PLS loads, click on Kernel on the left. Now make sure that you have the Restrict Events Kex listed. It should be here in your config and in your Kex folder. If you don't already have this Kex, there'll be a link to the GitHub page down below. Download the Kex from GitHub, unzip it and drop it into the EFI OC Kex folder of your EFI partition. It should then be picked up by OCAT and automatically added to your config.plist. With that kext installed, click on NVRAM on the left. Then click the second hexadecimal number down. Here we're going to add a new boot argument for restrict events. Click on the plus icon on the right, then under key type rev patch. R-E-V-P-A-T-C-H. Click the drop down under data type and select string as the type. And then for the value, we're going to type SBVMM. Then click on delete at the top. And again, we're going to click the plus icon to add a new entry and type rev patch. Now you can click the save icon at the top and quit OCAT. Finally, reboot your Hackintosh. After rebooting, I'm going to open system preferences again, go to general and then software updates. Now it immediately finds the 14.3.1 update and I can begin downloading it by clicking update now. If you're wondering what that new boot argument does, according to the restrict events documentation, rev patch equals SBVMM forces the VMM secure boot model, allowing OTA updates for unsupported models on macOS 11.3 or newer. I hope you found this video useful if you haven't been getting update notifications. If you have any questions, put them down in the comments below and I'll do my best to answer them. That's it for now, thanks for watching.